Nearly 300 people packed above and below deck on an old wooden fishing boat were rescued off the coast of Libya on Wednesday. The non-profit rescue ship, CI, found the boat adrift in the early hours of Wednesday morning and used rescue rafts to transport the migrants to the larger ship. After several other rescue operations, there were 416 migrants aboard the CI, including dozens of miners and a baby. The crew on board the rescue ship is requesting a safe port for the migrants to disembark. According to the UN High Commission for Refugees, 37,587 refugees and migrants have crossed the Mediterranean, arriving in Europe by sea in 2022. An estimated 742 have died or gone missing in the attempt. Devastating floodwaters that wiped out miles of roads and hundreds of bridges in Yellowstone National Park and swamped scores of homes in surrounding communities moved downstream Wednesday and threatened to cut off fresh drinking water to residents of Montana's largest city. Heavy weekend rains and melting mountain snow had the Yellowstone River flowing at a historically high level of 4.9 meters as it raised past Billings. The unprecedented and sudden flooding that raged through Yellowstone earlier this week drove all of the more than 10,000 visitors out of the nation's oldest park, which remains closed. It damaged hundreds of homes in nearby communities, though remarkably no one was reported hurt or killed. It also pushed a popular fishing river off course, possibly permanently, and may force roadways torn away by torrents of water to be rebuilt a safer distance away. Oh, that's where the radio is going. He's just at the point where, what do you, what do you do? Right. Yeah. Yeah. You know. Uh, you're gonna tell you in about another hour or two.